Um, so certainly I, I try to. You know, it really that wasn't anything uh, I didn't expect to do. I was uh, coming in, you know, training four four high, five low, back end speed, and I knew that the front end speed would be there going out. Um, it was uh, it was a little surreal. You know, I like went straight on the last 15 meters, and uh, I couldn't really tell where I was, where anybody else was. And I lunged for the wall. I went, you know, when you lunge, you like you look over, and there was like you know nobody else over there. Like that was where Caleb was. And I was like, oh man, I must be doing all right. <laughs> yeah, and the 48-1, it was. Uh, yeah, I mean, it was right on, right on goal time actually. So it was nothing I didn't expect to do. I came here to. To make the team, so gosh, that was uh, crazy. I was loving the uh, the headlines from all the all the swimming news, but um, we're working on the Apple. Team. Yeah, yeah, I could tell. It was funny. Um, yeah, you know, it was a uh, it was a little more more um, I don't want to say stress, but pressure, I guess, than usual. You know, <laughs> being the first final and being the top seed was uh yeah, it was interesting, but I knew. I knew I had the swim to get on the team, so I had the swim in me to get on the team. So <laughs> once it finally happened, yeah, yeah it felt great. Um, you know, I could tell Caleb was going to be in front of me. I couldn't really tell where Townley was or Nathan on the other side. Uh, so like, just put my head down and get to the wall and see the four. You know, knowing that I got the relay spot and be. Yeah. It was great. Yeah. I mean, yeah. I was leaving trials last year. You know, I watched the. The parade of like you know when they named the Olympic team and everything, and I was sitting in the stands and it was just like you know it felt bad. It just didn't I didn't want to have to like sit in the stands again and watch another team get named with me not on it. And so, you know, I think that's what motivated me all all season and yeah, what put together the swim. So. Um, you have to stay confident in your own race strategy. I mean, you can't change what you know you can do based off what other people around you are gonna do. Um, you know, obviously Caleb was like he's fast. You know, there's nothing about him that's not fast. But like, if he's if he's gonna go out super fast, or if he's not, or if, you know, it's not worth your your energy to worry about what everybody else is gonna do. You need to you know focus on your lane, your your swim. I don't I don't really know. I mean, I just I felt like my college. I know. I felt like my college season kind of reflected my long course season, honestly. Mm -hmm. um, you know, I was 18-9, 42-4, and I was 43-4 last year and 49-4, so I dropped a second 100 free short course, dropped a, a little over a second 200 free short course. So I knew that I could drop about a second going into this meet, and so I was expecting between 48-2 and 48-4, so to go 48-1 was... Yeah, you know, just the icing on the cake.